nothing like the sounds of your own neighborhood. This is a small damn neighborhood. Go away, SpongeBob. You're polluting my thinking space. Trying to steal the Krabby Patty formula again, eh, Plankton? Well, you won't get away with it. I've got bigger fish to fry. I've got to figure out how to regain control of the chum bucket from those robots. Where did they come from? Where? Um, I don't know. Not for me, though, that's for sure. They just showed up out of nowhere and started calling me rude names and throwing things. They even bent all my spoons. <laughs> I love those spoons like they were my children. That's terrible. Oh, won't you help me stop them? Before they bend all my forks? Not the forks! Of huh. course Not the forks. Sporks are worse, I though. They'd be well worse if it was sporks. Golden spatulas, eh? SpongeBob, if you can get me back into the chum bucket, I'll give you a bucket full of golden spatulas. In your dreams. You've got a deal. <laughs> well, okay. Well, we could go into jellyfish fields over here, but I think I'm gonna hold off. And you guys are just gonna have to be patient as I mess around in bikini bottom. So this is what happens when you go out of bounds. You're just gonna, I'm just gonna keep going. The hand, the hand, the hand it will come and pull you out and put you back. And it reset that. That's pretty amazing. There's like no power. Alright, I'm gonna hit this button. Oh, shit. Forgot about this. Now, I only have a fancy text box for the um, golden spatulas and the uh, socks. I completely forgot about the uh, golden underwear, or else I would have made one for that. But it's a little too late now, and I don't feel like going back and doing it. Because the golden, the gold, this, both the special and the sock text box took about a uh, 30 hour, 30 minutes. Let's just say 30 hours. Yeah, no. That it took, it took a little bit. There's people to talk to too, but I'm gonna try and get whatever's on top of SpongeBob's house right now. God dang it! God dang it! Oh god, that was difficult. Where are you going? You're not going anywhere. Can that not happen? Oh my god, on my computer, so much shit that loves to just pop up randomly. Oh, I missed! Well, I'm gonna let the timer out. Give me a second. God, I hate some things sometimes. I swear to god. Okay! Let's do this this time with more feeling. And wishing I could see more. So it's Veterans Day today. Thank you to all the veterans. Thank you to all the ve ve veterans out there um, that serve our country. You guys all do a good job. And there's my golden special, even though you can't see it. Yeah, I probably shouldn't be saving this game. <laughs> All right, hi, Mr. Bob, Krabs. This flapping robot crisis is making the Krusty Krab lose money like a sinking ship. No money means no more Krusty Krab. No more Krusty Krab means no more fry cooking for you. <laughs> no more fry cooking? But because you're gullible, I'm going to help you out. And of course, make a small profit in return. I've got a few golden spatulas that I'll be willing to trade to you for some of those shiny objects. You will? Of course. What are employers for? Besides, them shiny objects is worth lots of money. Your treasure chest's looking a bit light, boy. Do you think I've got bilge water on the brain? I ain't running a charity here. Come back when you've got enough shiny objects to trade. Thirty three thousand. Okay. Uh let's go talk to Bubble Man over here. I just dropped by to give you a bubble hand. Bubble buddy. You see, you're going to need to learn some new bubble blowing moves if you're going to journey to the ninth dimension and defeat a giant monkey man. But uh, all I need to do is figure out how to get rid of these robots. Oh, yeah, sorry. I've been in the soap bottle a little too long. Uh, where were we? Uh, something about new bubble moves. 
right! Press this button, and you'll launch yourself straight up in the air with bubble power that defeats anything that is directly above you! Try it out! Yeah, I know that! Thought I knew that. But apparently not. Damn, I fucked up. Don't forget. Okay, let's go into Squidward's house and see what Squidward's up to. Because he's always fun to mess with. Right! <laughs> right! <laughs> First, those stupid robots ruined a perfectly relaxing mud bath this morning. And now you show up. Can my day get any more dreary? I am so sorry, Squidward. Patrick and I were just playing a game and... Oh, I correct myself. I should have known that whole robot problem involved both of you. Squidward, I don't know what to do. How can I fix everything? Why don't you move to another town? That should help out more than enough. Ha! <laughs> ha! Move to another town. Ha! I cracked me up. <laughs> but seriously, just jump around like an idiot. That should at least make me smile. Or I can just destroy everything. Oh, excuse me. <laughs> A lot of suck. Oh, okay. Okay, okay, okay. Just stop jumping, will you? If you take this golden spatula, will you please go away? See, Squidward? I knew that you could help me out. You're the best. Don't touch me. <laughs> So that's how you get a lost sock and a golden spatula. That's so much fun. Like, you just fucking annoy the shit out of Squidward. It's amazing. It's pretty, pretty amazing. This game's pretty good, I'd say. Happy to be playing it. Okay, Patrick, what hey, you got? Patrick. Nice sock. What sock? The uh, one you're standing on. Oh, that one. It's lost. Well, if that one's lost, where are your other socks? Well, they're more lost. A bunch of robots came through here and stole my whole sock collection. I could use some help getting them back. Sure thing, Patrick. What are best friends for? Okay, then. For every ten socks you bring back to me, I'll give you a golden turkey baster. You mean spatula? Bless you. <laughs> I think I'm gonna try and collect as many as I can without running into Patrick because usually I like to just mess around on here alright let's go into Patrick's house because we can boom now pretty sure it's all that's in here though you get to turn on music which is always fun you can hit your head on the ceiling. I can do that over here. <laughs> okay, that's enough of that. <laughs> well, there's that lost sock. Um, we can't go over here unless we have 15. You need 10 to get over there. So there's only really one place we can go. The Jellyfish Fields. Let's go. I gotta mention, I really love the music in this game. At times. It's really like, it fits the environment of everything. Practically. <laughs> Jellyfish fields, a place to experience nature at its most raw, and sometimes a bit tender from the stings. Spotter! 
Nifty electrical touch attack, not tall enough to ride most roller coasters, but more vicious than a pack of rabid clams. Ow! Squidward, are you okay? No, I'm not okay, you barnacle head. Do I look like I'm okay? Well, your nose does look pretty big. I mean, bigger than usual because it's usually pretty big. And you look clammy. And oh my gosh, you're bald! I've always been bald, but now I'm stung all over. Well, according to the Jellyfisher Field Manual, severe jellyfish stings can be treated effectively by applying a thick layer of King Jellyfish Jelly to the affected areas. <laughs> King j -j Jellyfish? Well, I guess you're off to scale Spork Mountain and die a horrible death under the vicious tentacles of King Jellyfish. <laughs> I'll stay here, balled up here in excruciating pain. You do that! Don't worry, Squidward! I'll bring back that King Jellyfish jelly for you to rub all over yourself. Yeah, that wasn't dirty! Welcome to Jellyfish Fields. And I'm being chased by a robot. His name is Fodder. He's... As you saw in the description, he's too high. Or he's too... Oh. This is a teleport box. When you have both of the teleport boxes in the area open, you may teleport between them by jumping inside. So you, you have to open it, though. There's a lost sock out there. We can't do anything about it, though. So all we can do is just, you know... We can kill these jellyfish. I mean, they're jellyfish. They like to sting things. Because they're jerks. They can sting you. So be careful. About that. So we can just explore, you know, around here in jellyfish fields. I don't know what I'm saying. Get fodder out of here. Fodders. <laughs> you can also get combos. I don't know why they added that in the game. I guess just for fun. Die, jellyfish. Oh, shit. Don't destroy those. <laughs> Fuck. I can get up there, though. I'm up there. So many good, so many shiny things. How many do I need to move on? 125. This is, this is a lot. Early on, it's a lot. But we're not even done over here. There's so much to explore. You know, okay, well, let's go up here. Hi, Potter. You didn't even see me with the shit. When they spot you, they make, they always make a noise. All of them do. There are more than one robot. I hope you know that. Uh, we can get mon super monster combo. Reminder, yes, I know. Oh shit, we can't can't do anything about that. There. No, we can't. <laughs> There's a cat meowing. Shut up, I'm trying to record. Do you want to feed the clam 125? Yes, of course I do. This is this is so random. This is so random. What does this say? This is a checkpoint. If you are defeated after activating a checkpoint, you will restart at the checkpoint instead of at the beginning of the area. Get out of here. No one asked ya to say anything, you stupid fodder. Jellyfish! There's not much really to say. Um, ooh, 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 we can explain this. This is a freezy fruit. Only Patrick can use the freezy fruit. Well, that's pretty amazing. So, how have you guys been? I mean, I've been decent. I haven't been uploading a lot because school's been getting in the way pretty hardcore. Can, we, can I do anything about that? Oh, God, I thought I was still gonna fall in the water. Yeah, school's been keeping me busy. That's why I haven't been uploading much. I don't know how often this is going to get uploaded. I just want to really do this because I put a lot of time into this. I mean, yeah, really. <gasps> oh, I made it. I don't know how I made it, but I made it. Oh, I made it. Yeah, you can't get me. Fuck off. Ta-da! Ah, shit. Don't do that. Okay, well, whatever I did, don't do that. I'm ready. I'm ready. Because I killed myself, which is pretty amazing. Give me your monies. Uh, I have to do this again. Barely. Glit. Glit. You can't get me. Fuck off. 
You suck. Fighter. At least his name is Fighter. Ow, you dicks. They have that. If you get hit, you have a period of them laughing at you. So you can regain um, you getting hit and kill them. Usually. Eh. I like how buoyant those are. Kaboom. Yeah, I've already got six already. Jeez. That's outrageous. Purple gives the most, like that said, and whatnot. So yeah. Die, you stupid tikis. <sighs> or tikis. I like how. Oh, I need that actually. Or not. <laughs> okay, game. And then there's. I don't know what those things are. To be honest, it's really easy to dodge this though. Yes, SpongeBob. Hi, die. I don't know why I one shot that. Oh, hi, Gary. Wow, a bungee jump for a golden spatula. I must be in heaven. Okay, there is a way to glitch this out. Oh, god damn it. This is a bungee hook. SpongeBob can bungee from it. To bungee from the bungee hook, just jump up and touch it. To dive downward, press the X button. To exit the bungee hook, press the triangle button. Now, there's a way I could glitch this. Because there's a period of when you're going down, you can, like, get it to infinitely, like, go down. Ugh! I can't remember how to do it. But there was a way you could like, I swear there was a way. Oh, I know how. Let me try this. Oh, I know how. Hey, hey, hey. When you're going up. You could do that. I don't know. Ow, that hurt. Oh, hey! Golden spatula. Forgot about that. <laughs> but there was a way where I could, like, infinitely just, like, keep <laughs> going down on it. It was pretty amazing, if you ask me. Uh, press a button, and platforms will rise out of the ground. I don't understand, but okay, game. Whatever you think is cool. So up to you. No. Oh boy, a checkpoint. Oh, what's, who's that? Hammer. Impressive meat byproduct attack. Smarter than it looks. Goes well with broccoli and a nice Chianti? I don't know what that word is. And that is Hammer. Yeah, he's got a punny name. Shut up. But yes, I know. He'll come over to you. He'll try and hit. Ah, that's a shame. Oh, no. Well, you got to see what he did there. No, I must get... Combo. Damn it. It restarted. So that's Hammer. He's got a pretty punny goddamn name. I mean... When you got Ham in front of your first name and Hurt Mur Mur as your second name. Do you mind? Ham Mur. He even mentions it. Oh, Spongebob... Okay. That was nice to tell me. What you say now? Spot Bob needs to know the bubble bowl move in order to play this game. So we can't play this yet. We have to wait. We have, we have to wait. Ooh, what's over here? I don't remember ever going over here. Must be just money. Huh. Don't ever remember going that way ever in this game. But I practically memorized this first level. Later in levels, it'll be like, uh, what? But it'll be these first couple of levels. I don't memorize. Have memorized. Killing you. Oh, you. Oh, I see how it is, game. Okay. Destroy all the tikis. Like, seriously. Alright, this is fun. Die. Die. 
I, there's probably something up there. No, just underwear. I don't need underwear. This is goo. SpongeBob and Patrick can't swim and can't swim, so don't let fall. Don't let them fall in the goo. Yeah, there's a little force. Oh, this is funny. Dumbass. <laughs> I love doing that. I just come over here and I just kind of. Anybody? They'll lose interest when you're over here. Watch this. Ugh. Oh, I thought you can hit um, other robots into each other. It's pretty funny. Oh, okay. I'm gonna risk it. Or I'm not going to risk it because that can happen. I see how it is. Nope. Nope. You dick. Ugh. 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 <laughs> You're lucky. Your hit your no aggro box is different than everybody else's. Ch shit! Oh, destroyed that jellyfish. That's funny. Yeah, when you die, uh, everything restarts. It's kind of nice because your shine count, your shiny count, won't reset. So then you're just like, I can probably kill, like, if you find the place where you can grind on shiny things, because you're going to need a lot for the end of the game. Just saying. Um, yeah. So you'll have to do that. Alright, let's not screw this up again. I can do this a lot better. That's just fun to do. Eh. Yeah. Actually, that was me being automatically taken. Kaboom. And this is where the bungee jump is. Believe it or not. It's just held up by a propeller in a barrel. Somehow. Oh, wait, I'm curious. Can I see what's going on in there? Nah. Whoop up! I almost fell. Alright, let's go back. 360 no scope. Okay, never mind. And then you just do this to get over here. Open that box and he killed himself. GG. And you can teleport back here. So yeah. That's what the teleport boxes do. They're like the imaginary box from that one episode. That machine huffing and puffing over there is duplication duplicator. Could duplicatotron 1000. The D-1000 will continue to create robots until it's, it is destroyed. Be careful, though. It goes with, it goes out with a bang. Mm, sure does. You can also knock robots into it, which is pretty funny. You guys hit each other, GG. Yep. And if you need that, when that explodes, then you get hurt. Alright, let's collect our fifth. Alright, if it gets our fifth, it's either our fifth or sixth. It's our fifth. Our fifth golden spatula. <sighs> Alright. Let's keep going. And a jellyfish cave. 